Hello everyone, this is Kiran and I'm a corporate trainer by profession. Today we are going to talk about testers as training consultants or into corporate trainings. Now we all must have come across this very conflicting question in our career that what is next? This question is common not only amongst testers but from professionals of various roles. If you're really willing to grow, there's no stopping to versatility of any role. So training, mentoring and upskilling is certainly a new wing out. Corporate training is becoming a very valuable role for startups as well as established companies that invest in training uh, sessions and benefit from better productivity. Not all organizations are well equipped to train their manpower for present and future competencies and therefore this role is becoming so important and valuable. The skills required as corporate trainers include having excellent communication and presentation methods. You enjoy learning all the time along with your job specific functional and technical skills. Yes, a natural ease of dealing with people, the ability to uh, present themselves with confidence, to be able to speak in front of a large audience with conviction, uh, spontaneity to respond to difficult situations with ease, a good sense of humor, uh, maturity to uh, create training materials relevant to their audience, loads of enthusiasm and most importantly passion for the subject matter that is being presented. And the responsibilities of a trainer include accessing all the lacks in the working ecosystem of a company, creating and reviewing training content, conducting training programs, and evaluating and updating the status of all the trainees. Now the question arises, how to become a corporate trainer? So first of all, find your niche. You must have a degree or license. Getting certified can be even more helpful. Now build your own portfolio and then market yourself through webinars, networking and social media. Now you think you have it all, go for it.